Hi everybody, it's Crystal. So how's everybody doing today? Um, my Fiber Fanatics, my YouTube family, my Yanni peeps. I hope everybody's doing well and staying safe. So today I'm going to show you just a little bit of yarn that I got from Hobium. Um, just recently, um, they had a sale. Now if you're not familiar, I like to uh, tell everybody in the beginning about the yarn company that I shop in at because <clears throat> some people are new. And they might not have heard of Hobium before. So Hobium is based in Turkey. And they do have wonderful yarns, um, you know, and that you, some that you can't get in the U.S. And I really like Hobium, and I always have liked Hobium. Um, so I have bought from them a lot uh, of times. And I'll tell you a little bit about their shipping. They ship DH. Now I'm going to be speaking to the U.S., okay? Now they are an international yarn seller. They sell to many, many, many different countries. Um, um, but if you're not in the U.S., you might want to check out uh, their site, uh, hobianyarns.com, and um, look at the shipping rate if you're from a different country. But for the U.S., um, which is where, you know, where I'm from, um, they will give you free shipping on your order if you spend $150 or more. And I think that's actually not bad. Um, and I always try, when I when I buy from Hobium, I always try to save up the money to get the free shipping. I always try to do that everywhere that offers free shipping. I always try to uh, save up the money to get the free shipping. Now, if you don't... Um, do the free shipping if you don't have enough to save up for the free shipping their shipping is just about i would say the the going rate for um it might be just a bit more than other countries or a bit more than other places like michael's and and uh you know joann's because they get shipping rates because they're so it's such a big company hobium is just one company on its own but, and also it's coming from Turkey. But I will say that the shipping is really pretty fast from DHL. I usually get it within um, anywhere between two to five, two to four days usually uh, I get it. So, yeah, I can't really say anything bad about Hobium. They sell some really nice uh, name brand products. They sell like Lamia, DMC, um, Himalaya is a very nice brand. They started carrying. I like their Etrofill. Um... The Lauren brand, uh, they sell Rowan. I love Rowan. Rowan is a very nice brand. And they sell other things like hooks and, and stuff and whatnot. But I do want to mention that I'm not affiliated with Hobium at all. Um, I bought all this yarn myself. And I don't have affiliated links. But they did have a sale on the yarn that I bought. They had it 50% off. So I bought it. Okay, so you guys want to see it? Uh, a lot of it I will use for giveaways. Because a lot of people... Um, even though Hobium is nice and, you know, offers free shipping and everything, they, a lot of people still can't purchase, um, you know, from Hobium. So, I like to try to buy from Hobium once in a while and, and, um, put it in giveaways. So people can, you know, have a chance to try it for those of you, you know, that can't, you know, can't get it for some reason or, or another so let's see what we got here i'm going to bring it up on my laptop so i can tell you how much it costs now um <laughs> you've probably seen me get this have this before if you've been on my channel for a while um this is their just wool now this is 100 lamia is the brand 100 percent recycled wool i actually really really like this one this is my favorite color that they have it's brown with brown flex now i'm going to give you a price on this stuff but i want i'm going to give you the price it is now um but remember i did get mine 50 percent off they do have um sales too um so you just have to keep checking out checking back with them i signed up for their newsletter a long time ago so i always get a hit follow them on facebook so i always learn about their sales and stuff so anyways, this is, these, these are uh, just wool, it's 100% recycled wool, 126 yards, and it is a four weight. And you can see the brown with all the multicolored flex. I love yarn with flex in it. I don't even care what color the flex are. But these are um, 209 a ball. But with Hobium, 
you can buy the single or you can buy the whole pack. And if you buy the whole pack, which this is a pack of 10, you'll get 10% off each ball. So I did buy the whole pack, which made them $1.88 a ball. I like this. I've had about every color of it that they have. This is always, this one's been my favorite though. Okay. Now this is one that I don't think that I've ever had before from Hobium, but uh, I'm going to look at it and tell you about it. Okay. So this is their Amigurumi yarn. Now I'm not a big fan of Amigurumi, but that doesn't mean that it has to be used for Amigurumi. So let's look at it here. It is, um, Okay, so it's um, 130 meters, so um, about 145 yards of 51 acrylic, 49 cotton. So it's a cotton acrylic blend. And even though, like I said, even though it's amigurumi, it doesn't mean that you have to use it for amigurumi. I'm going to take a little slit in the bag, even though I will use a lot of this for giveaways, um, and see how it feels, see if it would be garment worthy. Uh, cotton acrylic blend. Yeah, that that would be uh, just fine for garments. You know, it's not it's not the softest like Pima cotton or anything, but it's way better. It's better than like peaches and cream that you can get from Walmart. No, they do. Let's see what they classify the weight as a uh, they don't have a weight classification on there. I don't know. I don't see no weight classification. If I see it, 142 yards. Well, I would give it a say. It's a three weight cotton. But yeah, that's not bad. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Uh, it's scarfable. Scarfable, if you're new, means uh, that it's an article or it, it's a type of yarn that I would wear against my skin. I would make a scarf out of it. I would make a sweater out of it, and it would not bother me to wear it with nothing underneath it. You know what I mean? It's just it's good, soft enough to be on your skin. So scarfable or is that that's my term for that. That's nice. So these are um 231 a piece or if you buy the 10 pack you do get 10% off. I always try to buy in packs since you get 10% off. Um they run 208 each for so that's what that is. That's a free pink one. Never had that. I never felt that before nice let's see what else we got here okay i've had this and i have made a few things out of my channel out of it. i have a beautiful beautiful easter dress i made my daughter on my channel out of this i really like this yarn and i bought it a gazillion times from hobium and i gave it away a gazillion times in giveaways and people people like it um I'm going to type it in here. Okay. So this is their uh, Gazal is the brand. It's a good brand. Oh, this one matches my shirt. Pretty close. Pretty close. So this is nice. This is a cotton acrylic blend. Um, it's 50-50 cotton acrylic. Gazal is the brand. Now this is XL baby cotton. The XL means that it's a four weight. They do have a regular Gazal baby cotton if, and it's a two weight. So if you prefer a four weight like me, you want to look for the XL. So it's nice that it's scarfable. Great. Like I said, I made my daughter in a very beautiful Easter dress and a bolero out of it. You can look for that on my channel. Um, and these are, um, 114 yards machine wash lay flat. I'll, um, most of these are these yarns that I've showed you so far are made in Turkey. Um, and then, yeah, so uh, 220 a piece or a dollar, a dollar 98 if you buy the 10 pack, which I did buy the 10 pack. Well, remember, they had this stuff 50% off when I bought it. Um, it's a good sale that they had. I like to take advantage of good sales and like I said I like Hobium anyways it's one of my favorite yarn companies 
that I can buy that, that's not not in the United States. So that's that pretty purple I got there. I did get it in um, a few other colors. Um, pretty orange. That's pretty, pretty, pretty. Very summer, summery, huh? And this would work well for summer summer projects too, having that cotton in it being soft. Ooh, another pretty summer color. Bright yellow, I love that. That just kind of looks citrusy, don't it? It does to me. <laughs> and then, let's see. Um, I think I've had this before, I don't quite remember. But uh, because I've had a lot from Homium, and I still have maybe a few yarns that I've never had, but not not too many. I've tried about all of them. Um, okay, so this is the Kartopu is the brand. I'm not gonna. Yeah, I gotta give it a little slice. I gotta feel it to tell you about it. I can't remember what it feels like if I've had it before. Kartopu Flora, which a bright neon pink. A little bit brighter when my camera's showing it's really neon pink so this floor yarn is it feels scarfable mm -hmm. i would wear a scarf out of it it's 100 acrylic um and there are got a lot of colors in it to choose from all are solid um 251 yards and they classify it as a lightweight three I would agree with that on a lightweight three, maybe a little bit of a, you know, a thicker three, but still a three. That's nice. That bright pink is something Evelyn would really, really love. But unfortunately, I don't work well with a white lightweight threes, even when I double them. I just, but I will, made in Turkey, uh, put it in a giveaway, more than likely. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, I didn't give you a price on that. I really liked it. My favorite. This is really pretty. I don't know if it's a pink, I think. I really like the neon pink. These are $2.20 a piece or $1.98 each if you buy a pack of five. These come in a five pack. So you'll get them for $1.98 if you buy the five pack. That's not bad for uh, that amount of 251 yards. Nice. I like that hot pink. Hot pink is beautiful. That's yeah, so it. got a lot of pretty colors of it, too. Um, let's see what else we got here. This is their Etrophil. Etrophil is a very nice brand that they carry. Um, Etrophil Jean Jarn. Someone was just asking me about that the other day. If I've ever had it before. And I have. I have had it before. But um, I'm going to do another open because it has been a while since I've had it. Pretty blue though. I got it in. So, um, Etrophil. That's nice. So it's 55 cotton and 45 acrylic. It is made in Turkey. That's what it looks like. Heterophil jeans. Desi made in Turkey, designed in Italy. There are um, 174 yards. Now on their uh, site, they do classify this as a number two weight. And I knew that it was not a number two from previous purchases. I would say that it's probably um, a three a normal three it's definitely not a two but uh you can see that probably you probably agree with me on that one more than likely but yes it's nice cotton acrylic uh, blend uh scarfable very pretty blue too i like that so these run um two dollars and 40 cents a piece or 216 if you buy a 10 pack of them which i did I bought the tin pack for giveaway, 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 and giveaway. Okay, I've had this before too. <laughs> I love Gazal. Look at that sticker. This is some more uh, baby uh, Gazal baby XL cotton. That's a pretty pink. I might keep that one and make something for Evelyn this summer. It's about it's. I busted it open anyways. That's pretty. Yeah. Evelyn will like that. I might make her dress out of that. Okay, I'm gonna show you this one real quick here. Now this is Etro or yeah, Etrophil. Uh 
Angora baby. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and talk about this one real quick. Um, so this is a uh, relatively well. Let's look at it. Feels nice. Let's read about it. Okay, so it is 15% Angora, 35% Viscose, and 50% Polymide. You can see the little hairs on it, which would be the the uh, Angora. It feels good. Nice. And I think it's good enough for baby. Yeah, that, that would make a pretty baby blanket with that blue there. It's a tiny ball. Let's look at it, though, as far as yardage goes. 100 and... Uh, 64 yards in that little ball. That's not bad. Now they on their site they classified as a number two. Again, I'm gonna say that's a solid three weight in my opinion. Very pretty. I like that. I do like it. And I've had it before. I have not used it because of it being a three weight. But these are a dollar eighty a piece for 164 yards of a three weight uh, with a little bit of angora in it. Um, or there is no, I don't see no discount if you buy them by the 10 pack. I actually think that might be a sale price, a dollar, dollar eighty a piece. But anyways, um, that would work well for a pretty a baby blanket. And there are, what did I say, the yardage was 164. I have 10 of them. That's 1,600, over 1,600 yards. That is enough right there um, to make me a very pretty baby blanket. Um... And um, I paid a dollar eighty each for a ten pack. So for eighteen dollars, that's gonna make a very nice, uh, very pretty soft baby blanket. I think that would be plenty for that, you know, or not enough, depending on the stitches. But I think that will do it. Maybe I'll have Mr. Bod make make me up a baby blanket. He uh, is my husband, if you don't know. The BOD stands for Bag O Day. It's a name that my subscribers gave him a long time ago, so I call him Mr. Bod too. Even when I'm not on video, I'm at home I'm like hey Mr. Bye come here anyways um sometimes I'll crochet baby blankets for my channel because I really don't like to crochet blankets at all so he'll do that and he'll work with the three-way it won't bother him I have arthritis so I can't do it anymore I like that blue I actually I like this one too this one is uh kind of summery looking it's got the citrus look citrus looking I guess orange in um yellow so i might put that one in a giveaway and i might keep this one and see if maybe i can get my husband to do a little baby blanket out of it i think maybe i have two of those and i don't know if i can make i might be able to use it to make a set with it people have been wanting me to make a set like a blanket and a sweater or something for baby newborn babies i hate using a three weight though but I'll think about that. I'll think about that in a second. Okay, I have a little bit more here. More of the uh, baby cotton because I really, really like that. And I wanted, I thought that since I was getting the stuff to give away, you know, because it was, uh, you know, I had a good sale that you guys would like it too. That purple is very pretty. Again, it's in that different color of purple. That's beautiful. Oh, that was pretty too. My goodness. I don't know which one Evelyn will like better. Oh no, this one is an XL. I, I must have made a mistake. So this is the two weight one, as you can see. It's pretty though. See how when I hold it back, how bright that is. I'll have to put that in a giveaway because I can't use that thin yarn. That's okay though. Um, here's some more of the amigurumi. But remember, you don't have to use that for amigurumi. It's, it's you know, that'd be great for lots of things. Some are, art, some are uh, articles and stuff. Oh, I, okay. I got two, <laughs> I didn't get two of these blues. I don't, here's that blue and Ethel Ford Angora. So that I'm going to give away. I got two of these pink ones. I guess I'm always thinking of Evelyn because my baby is a girl. So, well, she's five now, but uh, she's still my baby. She's, a, I guess, uh, thinking of her. So maybe I might keep these two and make some type of layout set or whatever it's called. And um, 
I bet you guys could use different colors, you know, for boy, girl, whatever colors you want to use. Um, and then I got it in this one, which I'll put in a giveaway. Remember, there's enough on one of these to make a make a baby blanket. This one's pretty, too. It's got red, green, and yellow uh, flecks in it. Okay, I really like that blue one, though. It's very pretty. I know, you never know what I'll do. Okay, and I got one more here I want to show you. This one I bought for myself to keep. Um, I won't be putting this one in a giveaway. Um, I can't remember. I think this might be one that I, I haven't had before. Um, to tell you the truth. Um, but we're going to check it out right now. Okay. This is their, uh, I'm gonna open it up here. Etrophil Bambino Luxe Wool. It's, it's nice, it's, it's soft. It's scarfable. It's pretty. 60% merino and 40% acrylic. Hand wash, lay flat, designed designed in Italy, made in Turkey. Um, that is beautiful, beautiful yarn. They have lots of pretty colors, all solids. And there are 174 yards, and they classify this as a number four. And I would agree with that being a number four. I like that one. But like I said, I'm going to keep this one for myself. Um, I do want to make something out of this color, uh, a pink here. Um, these run 350 a ball. Um, it's due to that 60% uh, merino, I'm sure. And um, a 10 pack would be 315 each if you buy the pack of 10. And that's what I did. But I don't think, still don't think that's a bad deal because I like it a lot. Very pretty. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's my hobium haul. What do you guys think about it? Hello. I'm keeping out of all that three bags. And the rest I'm going to put in some giveaways. You guys will enjoy that. So thank you everybody for watching. Um, remember to check out hobium. Uh, well, I'm not affiliated, but I just remember it is one of my favorite online companies that I can buy that is not in the States. And, and um, you know, they got good quality yarn, so I, I, I do enjoy them. Um, so thank you, like I said, for watching. I, I hope uh, I didn't bore you or anything. <laughs> I worry about boring you guys sometimes. But uh, I uh, will talk to you guys on my next video. It will be within a 24-hour period because it always is. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye.